Hey Jeff here, you know, focusing more on weight loss because that's such a big thing right now. But before I get into that, love for you to hit that subscribe button on this YouTube channel. Give me a thumbs up, give me a comment, whatever it is, share it with your friends and family. Just down to earth ideas on how to live a healthier life. Not about six pack abs, it's not about 6% body fat. Those things may come, but you know what? Just doing simple things get a better quality of life. You know, when, I am, when I'm in the gym and seeing people who really are very overweight and sometimes they're coached by trainers or they're doing you know coached by someone who's just into exercise you know and you take someone who is very overweight and you have them do high intensity things like jumping up and down off of boxes and you're like you know these these coaches or their trainers are like yeah you gotta burn this off you gotta do this sometimes that can be disheartening for people and I don't mean that you shouldn't challenge yourself but especially starting out I always talk about the big five exercises that I like people to do when beginning because it gives you a good baseline. A pressing motion, a pulling motion, get your back, chest, front and back of the shoulders, biceps and triceps all in two exercises. You do a shoulder movement, especially a pushing shoulder movement, not the lateral raise, that's a good exercise, but get a pushing motion where you get the triceps engaged as well. And then getting that leg press, okay? Not talking about extensions and curls, but a leg press. You know, you can shy away, I think, from squats for a while, but if you do a press, it's getting so many of those muscle groups and the legs working. Legs are very, very important to keep strong. And then that core, you know, I get it on a stability ball, I get people doing the front of the, of the abs, and then the, the rear, the, the, the lower back, because again, balance is the key. But five exercises, or maybe that's six right there, um, is key. It's a good baseline to get into, and then you can, as you start to get stronger, Get into those higher intensity things, that's okay. But to start people off on it, especially when they're in, in a very, you know, um, they're, they're very into how they look and, and so forth as far as conscious of that stuff, may not be the best idea. All right, we're taking healthy back here at Jeff Patag Fitness. Love for you to hit the subscribe button on this YouTube channel, share with your friends and family, and we'll talk to you again soon.